first at 10 terrifying moments in Denton, an apartment floor collapses. Half a dozen people went crashing to the floor below. Good evening and thank you for being with us tonight. I'm Marisa Vedra. This all happened at a homecoming party, a party that students say got out of control. News 8's Todd Unger is in Denton tonight with more on a situation that could have been so much worse. Some of these tenants are finally being allowed back into their units tonight to get what they can before being forced to go elsewhere for the evening. Meanwhile, for anyone that was actually inside of this complex when that floor gave way, it has been a very long 24 hours indeed. The cell phone videos making the Twitter rounds are stunning. An entire floor collapsing as roughly 50 partygoers descended on a Denton apartment. I don't know how many people are hurt. I, I don't, I, we, need, we need an emergency team out here, right? Now. I couldn't believe what was happening because when I felt the floor shake, I yelled like, yo, like people need to leave. Abiola Busari was hosting the homecoming yeah, celebration yeah. in the third floor unit at the Ridge at North Texas. He says too many people he didn't know showed up, and when they started to dance, the unthinkable happened. I could feel the floor starting to shake, and then the floor, you know, it just gave way, so I fell through, a bunch of my friends fell through, a bunch of people I didn't know fell through. His older brother was there too. Everybody started screaming. It was dark, it was pitch black. But dented fire officials say somehow no one was seriously injured. Still, the damage left by a gaping hole speaks for itself. TVs, computers, just everything. Everything you need for college, it's gone. Carly Carroll lives in the unit directly underneath where the floor collapsed. Fortunately, she and three roomies weren't home at the time. The ceiling has shook like every time they have a party because it's often, but I never would have suspected that something like this would happen. The complex and UNT say they're working to help about 50 tenants, many of them students, find temporary housing while investigators work to determine what comes next. In Denton, Todd Unger, Channel 8 News.